Beverly here with Get Nail Nail Art. So this is my Gothic Filigree and Roses video. I just redid it because I was getting a lot of questions. I wanted to clear some things up. And I couldn't monetize this video because I had the skillet song on there. So I just went ahead and took that off and narrated over it. So some of the questions that I've had is, um, you know, what, what did I use that was blue, this and that. You guys can read under the video. Um, anyway, I started off with just some black tips. And I'm going to do some red roses and some filigree. This is this stuff is not blue. Everybody thinks it's blue. It's not. It's just the way the video looks. This is foil glue. Um, and you can use the same, the, um, basically the same thing you can get at Scrap Perfect. Um, it's a glue you get from Scrap Perfect. It's called the best glue ever. And then this, the silver on here that you're seeing now is just where the glue has dried. And I put silver foil over top of it. And then I'll be using some red India ink. Um, that's to do the roses. And I'm using a regular calligraphy pen, a dip pen, that I got from my local craft store to do this. And um, I've also seen them in Walmart. You can find them in the, the aisle that they have all the art paper and stuff in and the watercolors. Anyway, um, so right now I'm just using black. And I'm putting some little filigree swirls here and there over top of the silver just to break it up some more. And I'll let you be, I'll be quiet and let you watch that. Just little swooshes and circles and just little filigree moves here and there. And usually I only do one nail, but I did a whole hand because this was just so pretty when I did it. I wanted to do it again and do like a full hand. Okay, so this is what it should look like. I took the black and I went up the nail and I just drew um, where I want my roses and my leaves to go. And basically it's just a... A circle with a very shaky hand is that's gonna be my rose and then my leaves you know you guys I'm sure you know how to make a leaf and then I put some filigree in there and you can see here it's basically just two vines of filigree straight up the nail And then I'm going to switch to the red. And I'm putting my roses in with the red. And for that, I used, um, I was going to use the India ink, but that wasn't working out so well. Um, it wasn't showing up very good over black, so I went ahead and used red uh, acrylic paint. My red that I bought, the India ink was just too light over top of this black these are just some little red dots i got them at my local craft store um it's martha stewart stuff it comes in a little bottle um so i top coated it and i threw a bunch of the little red circles on so that it looks like little jewels and that is that's exactly what it looks like is the little jewels And you just put them wherever you think you need them. So then I basically went in. Um, don't forget to go in with your black and add little lines inside of your roses to make them look like roses. So I hope this cleared up a lot. Um, if you have any more questions, post them under this video. And don't forget to subscribe, please. Thanks for watching, guys.